Okay, what's good with you guys? Um, this is a follow-up to the unboxing video. Man, the guy actually sent me all fake shoes. <laughs> so, man, it's unfortunate, um, but we cannot accept any of them. Because once you spot one fake, I mean, they, what, they're all fake, you know? Because look at this right here, okay? So we have two Jordan 11s. One is real and one is fake. Guess which one's which? Okay, so look at this first one here. You can look at this material, the way it shines in the light. This is very good, high quality, high end. And even look at the inside of this plush right here. So this is the Legend Blue Jordan 11, Legend Blue, low tops. You might be familiar with the Columbia, so it's the same shoe, but just a low top format. So I kept these for a couple years and you can really see, it does have a leather upper, kind of like how the Gratitudes were this last past year. But if you look at the tongue, it has really good materials. Now look at this shoe. So this is supposed to be uh, the 7210, which is a really good shoe too. So if you can look at this, this, this uh, mesh material, it's very stiff. And we know the 11's mesh is supposed to be known for the highest quality materials. And so if you look at this tongue, it is very stiff. And there is, you, you can't see any reflection coming from that light. You know, barely any movement when the light hits it. Completely different pattern. Inconsistencies with the stitching. And then look at the back here. What do you notice about that? 23 is off. It's supposed to be situated a little bit better than that. It's supposed to be lined up correctly because look at this one. 23 is looking really good. Perfect design. This one just looks like off. And then look at the jump man consistency on your, your white shoe. Now look at how the jump man is placed on this shoe. Something's just not right. And also look at this one. Okay, so now we're gonna move on to our next shoe that we can spot a fake as well, right? So this guy, I guess he sells fake shoes because, okay, we have two more shoes. And uh, if you look at both shoes, what do you notice about one of them? That the color is slightly off in the elephant print. And look at the elephant print on this shoe compared to the elephant print on this shoe. One of them is different. One of them is more uh, pristine, chiseled to look like the elephant print. This one looks like an alien invasion or some bacteria got out of the Petri dish, okay? <laughs> Man, and then, okay, the dead giveaway for this one was the tongue. Okay, look at the tongue on this one. Look at how good this tongue looks, right? It's perfectly, it's curved, it's tucked in. I know because I've had this shoe a few different times and bought it. You see what I'm saying? There it is, right there. Now look at the tongue on this one. This looks like an SB Dunk, okay? <laughs> Come on now. You, If you look at this tongue and you touch it, it's stiff, very stiff. Leather. Look at the toe box. Look at the overall shape of this shoe versus the shape of this shoe. It's supposed to be perfectly curved, perfectly um, kind of almost like an hourglass. And you can tell it instantly the difference between these two. And I mean, guys, be careful out here when you buy these shoes because, man, you could buy a fake pair and not even know it. I mean, I know it because I know this shoe very well. And, of course, there's some, there's some more dead giveaways. Oh, the backs. Especially the backs. You can tell by the spacing of the air the way the jump man looks, I mean, that is really close. But I mean, you could you can tell by the way the oval is. You see how this oval is, it's off. Look at that. You see you see that? They just cut it too soon and this is more of a flushed out. Man, that's bad, dude. Yeah. So I mean, guys, you got to be careful out here. If you're if you're not like well trained and well suited you wouldn't be able to spot the different fakes. But man, make sure y'all are careful out here. And our last shoe, man, the dead giveaway was this guy is selling fake shoes. Look at this, look at this. There's no jump man. I remember my cousin having these shoes and also this girl from elementary school had these 
there it doesn't matter how beat up this shoe is there will be a jump man present in this shoe so if you sell me one fake shoe you might be able to get away with it one fake shoe shame on me two fake shoes shame on you okay how did i no what does it say fool me once shame on you dang that was messed up fool me twice shame on me fool me thrice with three fake shoes buy one get one shame free man we about to send him back send him back get your money back we don't buy fake shoes because this is fortunes of footwear let's go